I'm Darwin Leon Toussaint. Um, and I'm a 1998 graduate of the College of the Bahamas. At that time, I would have pursued the Associate of Arts degree in Computer Data Processing. During the time that I was here, I was recruited to work at the College of the Bahamas. This would have been in 1997. I can remember now, it was October 97. And I told the then Director of Admissions, Ms. Veronica Cauley, I want to complete my computer degree. And she said, you're doing so well, we want you to work at the College of the Bahamas. I said, but I won't go off to school. She said, yeah, we'll work all of it out. So I started admissions as a temp in 97, um, confirmed up to December. By January 1998, I became a full-time employee at the College of the Bahamas. And so January of this year made 20 years since I've been working at the institution. And now I serve as the director of campus life. Many persons feel as if that you know, you have to go off in order to have this passion, in order to have this knowledge. But listen, I never went off until I really started my master's degree. Up to my undergrad, all of that came from the College of the Bahamas. And I'm very proud because I tell persons, even on recruitment, I said, listen, a degree from the College of the Bahamas will prepare you to go anywhere in the world. One of the best moments for me was I met my wife on campus. All right. Um, I actually met her in the library. Um, and so, we met, I, I was a very smart student. I really wasn't interested in anything. She used to pass the library every day and say, hi, Darwin. And I'd be like, this girl want me, but you know, I'm trying to focus on my education. But that was one of my best moments when I met my wife um, at the time. And she empowered me, I empowered her. We studied together, we continued on together. And eventually we got married in 2000. I want to say to the other alumni that the College of the Bahamas, now the University of the Bahamas has come so far. Okay, you need to actually come on campus to experience the improvements. Now, I can tell you, while I was here as a student, I could still recall the fence property and actually jumping the fence in front of McDonald's 3 a.m. in the morning just to get the records to try to be the first person on the line. And even when I got there, 12 people were still in front of me. And I'm like, these people ain't sleeping. Now we've moved away from that. We got online registration. Um, we got a new bond system that's involved. We have more scholarship opportunities. Back in the day when I was here, it was $25 for credit. Okay, yeah, we're a little bit more now, but it's more scholarship opportunities. You get to come and see the library. Come and see the Franklin R. Wilson Center. Come and see the Small Island Sustainability. Come and just experience the, the new entrance. I mean, get a feel of the campus. You could see that it is changing and your mayor presence alone will get to speak volumes because other persons will get to see you coming back, you love this place, and just come back and contribute.